East Berlin Christmas market attracts a different sort of crowd. The typical visitor is furry and will do just about anything for a treat. Yes, it's a Christmas market for dogs. Now in its sixth year, its founder says it's more popular than ever. At the usual Christmas markets, there's no place for dogs. They get stepped on. There's nothing for them to eat or drink. Instead, there's only stress. Here, they can relax. Owners who want to make sure their canines don't feel left out of the Christmas cheer can buy their pups a pillow or even have their portraits drawn. Dozens of vendors offer everything from gourmet food to fashion chic, as the owner of the EcoDog brand explains. EcoDog is green fashion for dogs. We have leather collars and leashes that are not only stylish but different from conventional leather. This market may be a bit out of the ordinary, but it's part of a long-standing tradition. Christmas markets have been held in the German-speaking world since the late Middle Ages. Now there are more than 2,000 across Germany. The markets are also a big revenue generator. According to a recent estimate, they bring in about $3 billion annually. And for those who want to pretend it's still the late Middle Ages, there's a Christmas market for that, complete with some unusual activities. Here you can shoot a bow or throw an axe. It's a beautiful Christmas market. It's a historic Christmas market. You might want to keep the kids on this side of the market. But whether you're arriving on two legs or four, chances are in Berlin, you won't have to jump through too many hoops to find the perfect Christmas market. Ira Spitzer, TRT World, Berlin.